Lord, welcome you to Kingdom Glory Lutheran Church as we gather today in Jesus' name. Thank you for your presence here. I want to say a special welcome to all the guests today for Braxton's baptism. Excited for that as part of the service this morning. And I have a few announcements as we begin our time together. Um, I wanted to mention that today is an indoor service, of, of course. And uh, next Sunday, we will have our last outdoor service for the summer um, on the back patio here at church. And uh, starting in September, we'll go back to always indoors uh, for indoor worship services. And also in September, you can mark this down, starting September 6th, our worship service will go to 1015, um, our regular fall school year schedule. Um, starting that September 6th will be indoors and 1015. Um, and so that's the, the switch coming here in the next couple of weeks. Next door, next week, outdoors, the week after, indoors, <coughs> then indoors uh, from there on out. Um, also, uh, there's a bag of cucumbers. Uh, Jacobowski's brought that. If you would like to take some, they're, they're giving that away. Uh, so go ahead and grab that from the uh, office as well this morning. Um, all right, uh, let's pray as we uh, gather to worship here. Uh, Father, thank you so much for this day. We praise you for uh, this time to be together in Christ and to worship and to praise your name, to hear from your word, to see you at work in our lives and through our lives. And so, Father, we pray that you would be glorified in this time, that you would do your work in us, in our hearts, and in, in, in us and through us, Lord. And we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. And let's sing our uh, opening hymn, number 172, Crown Him with Many Crowns, number 59 in the large print. Let's sing together. <laughs> Thank you. 
we crown the Lord Jesus as King, and He's the King of glory, He's the King of creation, and we worship Him, and in light of who He is, and in light of who we are, we come as people who live our lives, and we, we sin, we sin daily, and uh, that's part of coming to church, is coming to receive God's grace and mercy again and again, as He's a patient God. So, let's take a time to confess our sins with a moment of silence before the Lord, Take a time to, to talk to God and to tell Him uh, how we've sinned against Him in thought, word, and deed. So let's confess our sins. For then he would have had to suffer repeatedly since the foundation of the world. 
But as it is, he has appeared once for all at the end of the ages to put away sin by the sacrifice of himself. And just as it is appointed for man to die once, and after that comes judgment, so Christ, having been offered once to bear the sins of many, will appear a second time, not to deal with sin, but to save those who are eagerly waiting for him. And uh, here ends the scripture reading. You may be seated. I'm so excited to have uh, Michael and Ashley Seaford and his family and their friends here this morning. So I'd invite uh, everyone for the baptism to, to come and stand here. Yeah. 
And there's also the congregation here today, uh, thinking of both family that's gathered and, and the rest of the church family. And uh, so uh, we saw Braxton get plunged into the, the waters of grace this morning. And so I ask you as a congregation, do you promise to pray for Braxton and to uh, support him as he grows up in the Lord? If so, say, I do. I do. I do. I think, thank you. I love that support for uh, growing in Christ. All right, let's welcome Braxton into the into the family. This is a tradition we often use this song to dedicate to, and we'll dedicate it to Braxton Decor here today. It's called Master. You made me my own You formed me in my mother's side. You saw my bones being formed in the new shape. When I was put together there, you saw my body that it was here. I praise you because you made me amazing. Thank you. 